Question number 27. The following data point data shows the points scored by four different players. Each player scored an average of 18 points. Which player's data has the highest mean absolute deviation? So please recall mean absolute deviation. That is a measure of spread. It tells us how spread out the data is. Is it all clumped together in one little clump? Or is it spread out nice and wide, far away from the mean? Okay, so there is a way to calculate mean absolute deviation. But we're just going to eyeball this one because most likely on the map test we're not going to be calculating the mean absolute deviation. So we want to see which data is the most spread out from 18. So if we look at Alex, he has 18, 18, 18, 18, 18. His data is not at all spread out. It's all clumped right on 18. So the mean absolute deviation of Alex, his mat is going to equal 0 because all of his data points are right on the mean. So we need to find which one is the most spread out away from 18. Bernard, even though not every data point is 18, all of his data is really close to 18. 16 is only 2 away, 17 is 1 away, 18 is the mean, 19 is 1 away, 20 is 2 away. So that's going to have a pretty small mean absolute deviation as well. So you look at C and D, which one is the most spread out? Whichever one is the most spread out will have the highest mean absolute deviation.